friends welcome back to shan's kitchen so today as you can see from my display i'll be making some soup but what kind of soup some cow food soup i have not a lot of cow food here because i'm not cooking for a lot of people but it's been washed with um vinegar and lemon juice so what i'm gonna do is just quickly season it up this is just some all-purpose from Jamaica. I see you got all the spices and stuff in there. Put some pimento. This is some green seasoning that I've made. And um, garlic and onion season. And I will season that up now. So here I have my seasoned cow foot. And cow foot is a lot of bone. Not much meat at all, to be honest. But it's good for you. In the bone marrow, we got lots of protein, magnesium, phosphate, calcium, lots of goodness in there. And also, growing up in Jamaica, cow food good for the man, them good for the woman, them too. It's good aphrodisiac. And here we go. It's been seasoned, it's tough, and I don't have three hours to cook it on the stove top, so I'm going to pressure it in my pressure cooker. And I have um, five cups of water here, which I'm just going to add to it. Boiling water. I'm just set it off, make it pressure. But because I want to get some flavoring from the beginning stages, I got some um, spring onion, onion about five cloves of um garlic i'm gonna throw some pimento seed a little bit of thyme this is just to pressure it with i will add more of these goodies later on but now we have nothing so let me just rinse this out and add it and then i i will pressure for um 30 minutes 30 to 40 minutes there ready for start pressure so let's put the lid on so the pot just start pressure and over here i just need about a cup cup and a half of flour to make some spinners and i got my vegetables some cocoa piece of yam a little bit of pumpkin because my husband don't love pumpkin corn and shocho and the cock soup omega protein after so I will come back to you guys when everything is pressured and ready. Then I'll add all the other bits. Yes, people. So it's been pressured. It is nice and soft. And what I'm going to do now, I'm going to transfer it from the pressure cooker to my soup pot. Nice and soft, very soft. So we started out with five cups of water. This is what is left. And now I'm going to add some more boiling water to it because obviously this is not enough for the soup. Another five, another five cups. That's enough. And I have um, pumpkin and the carrots and some chocha here. And I'm just going to add that directly to the pot. And we're going to leave it to come to a boil. Allow it to cook again for another 20 to 30 minutes. And then afterwards, then I'll add the yam and the dumpling and the stuff then. Yes, guys, pot a bubble like trouble. It's been cooking for the 20 minutes. I really want the um, pumpkin to get mashed out so that it's not visible for my husband to eat. All right, so now what I'm going to do, I'm going to put the food in. So I like to prepare before I 
peel them and I put them in cold water so they don't get brown. And I've just got to wash my hands regular when I cook, guys. My hands are clean. Um, two Irish potato and two cocoa and a piece of yam, puna yam, the Ghanaian yam, nice yam. Yellow yam is a good yam for the soup as well, but I didn't fancy that today. The rest I'm going to cook for them. Alright. I'm going to make that go and boil up. And I'm going to add the dumplings as well. Yeah. And I'm just going to make small dumplings. But mostly spinners. Little and neat, just like I like them. And um, this is all I make the spinners. You know, I make them too small, like when you make stew peas, you know. So just pinch off a bit. So, dumpling and everything in the pot. Right now, I just want to put the noodles, some more scallion and thyme and season it up, the corn, and then just leave it to cook for another 30 minutes and then we're done. So, dumpling and everything in the pot. Right now, I just want to put the noodles, some more scallion and thyme and season it up, the corn. And then just leave it to cook for another 30 minutes and then we're done so guys it's come to an end you know green top i'm gonna use for the soup but um we gotta work with what we have i only had a red one um so we pressured for 40 minutes then put the vegetable in and cooked for 20 minutes then afterwards i put the dumpling and the yam and corn and everybody the noodles season it up and cook for another 30 minutes and this is the end result